to the gentlelady from uh, Wyoming, uh, Ms. Hagman. Gentlelady is recognized. Mr. Speaker, we have a crisis at our southern border. It is a crisis that started in earnest on the day this president was sworn into office. On day one of his presidency, he began issuing executive orders to end the successful policies implemented by the Trump administration. In total, President Biden issued 94 executive orders related to the border within his first 100 days in office. And the results have been disastrous. Over 10 times the population of my home state of Wyoming has illegally crossed the border since Joe Biden has been president. At the same time, over 14,000 pounds of fentanyl have come across the southwest border, enough to kill over 3.1 billion people. Through the first six months of 2023, 80 people who appeared on the terror watch list have been caught trying to cross into the United States, more than the last five years combined. How many slipped through? We don't know. These numbers show that without a doubt, Joe Biden has enabled the largest drug smuggling and human trafficking operation in U.S. history, and he has made our country less safe in the process. Stopping illegal immigration is the number one issue for my constituents in Wyoming. We must fix this situation, and H.R. 2 does just that. It is time to finish the wall, end catch and release, protect women and children from human traffickers, stop the illegal drugs flowing into the country, fix our broken asylum process, and force this administration to finally address the, the disaster that they have created. And with that, Mr. Speaker, I yield back. Gentlemen, reserve.